So this is my Marc Jacob box that I got from Influenza to review on Kinks and Kisses Airbrush by Marc Jacobs. And um, the coloring, you probably can't see that good because of my lighting. Let me see if I can get some of that outside lighting in there, honey. Don't worry about my background. It's very pretty. Um, I own a few blushes. And um, this is a little card that came on there to protect it. They made it. I read about it online. So, honey, I know about this little blush. It was... um. Mark Jacobs did this as something from the 50 uh, Studio 54 Days um, where women in the club will be dancing and after a long night of dancing and having fun, they would naturally have this flush tone to their cheeks and he wanted to do something to represent that. So he came up with these tones. This is the one I got, Kings and Kisses. He made it into like an old style cigarette case. This is a little button you push, it pops open. Um, I'm really picky about my blush. Now, this is a blush in like a highlighter. It's not just the blush. Now, it is very hard to just maybe get the pink if you want to just do the pink. This is you use. It comes with a booklet to show you how to put it on different ways. Um, I am really funny about blush. I don't like to look like a clown. I don't like my blush to be too heavy, too pink, too red, too purple, too blue, whatever. And to be honest with you... I actually really like this blush. Um, it does give your skin like a natural sheen, like a natural flush color. It's a build up. So if you want it more intense, you can build it up. You can use this to blend it out. I also use this as my highlight before I put on my actual highlighter. And it gives your cheek this beautiful, beautiful glow. I have pictures on my Instagram, um, pictures on my Twitter. I have gotten compliments from it. So I must say that I think this is pretty expensive, but I think... It's definitely worth the money, $42 for this, especially when you have a hard time finding blush. But I wanted to do a small video about it um, and my review on it. I really do so love it. This is my go-to. I try not to use it too much because then I will be upset that when it runs out and I have to go back to my other blushes. I've actually, throughout the whole summer, I've skipped a lot of days not wearing blush because sometimes I already wear a lot of makeup for the most part or enough. And the blush kind of takes it over the top. But this, I must say, I really, truly love. I've worn it a few times. I've been out. Um, I've been like a clown and look too made up. You know, so. If I had to say, if you can spend the money, uh, do it. They have three other, I believe, shades uh, from Marc Jacobs. Um, thank you, Influenza, for allowing me to try this i am a makeup junkie so when i saw this and i got the email that i was receiving this to review let me tell you honey i was at my mailbox every day getting off work i had to make sure that i got this make sure no one went in my mail and took this because honey when it comes to mark jacobs or when it comes to high brand especially being that i'm a budget queen um i could not miss out on this opportunity and it is so worth it i really really want to thank influenza um this is my new go-to blush this is what i go to as soon as i'm about to step out the house i put my blush on this is the blush i go to um so thank you i appreciate it and pieces